Hello and welcome to the Reiki Gem Wellness channel. Today, we're going to be talking about the top four crystal wisdom benefits of working with Seraphinite, the stone of the angels. For those that are new to the channel, my name is Shannon and I'm a certified Reiki master and teacher and a certified gemologist. And I combine those skills and passions to provide you with the knowledge, the tools, and the opportunities to practice incorporating crystal wisdom into your everyday life. And today we're going to learn how Seraphinite, the stone of the angels, can help support you in your everyday life situations. And let me tell you, I am so happy to be introducing you to this stone. If you've never encountered Seraphinite before, this is absolutely one of my favorite gemstones. It is found primarily in Russia. It is, it may look gray on the surface on the camera, but it's actually a very dark green. And some examples, some specimen also have some black with it, like this piece right here. And it's like a, a darker shade of this green right here. And it is just one of my favorite stones. It's so unique. And there's, there's really just not another gemstone that looks quite like this. And it is known as the stone of the angels. So the first benefit of working with Seraphinite is that it helps to strengthen your connection to your guardian angels. Now, this doesn't strictly apply just to angels. This also helps with your connection to your spirit guides, the universe, or any other external source of support and wisdom that you feel can guide you in life. It helps you to one, make that connection. If you feel like that's something you've been missing in your life, or if you have felt your guide presence before, it helps to strengthen that connection. And it really helps you feel their support and protection whenever you need it in life, especially when life is difficult, when it's giving you lots of challenges and you would like to receive wisdom or feel protected from your spirit guides. This is an excellent stone to sit and meditate with. The second benefit of working with Seraphinite is that it helps with heart healing. This is a green stone and it resonates with the heart chakra and it helps you to recover from breakups, from heartache and from trauma. It helps to create a very safe, and supportive space for you to heal, to experience those feelings and to then be able to release them when you feel ready. This is a wonderful stone to have with you, really if you have recently experienced a breakup because it helps you to not sink into self-blame and it instills a very deep appreciation and gratitude for yourself. It helps to reinforce self-love and to know that even though that relationship didn't work out, that you are worthy of love, that that just wasn't the right person at that time in your life. You are worthy of love and it will be there for you. This is a great stone to sit with. If you are in therapy recovering from a trauma in your life, especially an emotional trauma, it helps you feel safe and protected. The third benefit of working with Seraphinite is that it helps with meditation. If you are a person that feels like meditation is difficult, that you can't really get settled, you can't get your mind to stop jumping around, that you find it difficult to find time for meditation. This is a gemstone that really helps you settle into your space, 
into the present moment and release whatever might be feeling swirly or chaotic in your heart, your body, or your mind, and then settle into deep meditation. And this reflects a little bit of the black in the gemstone that ties in with our root and foot chakras to help us feel grounded, to help us feel safe and protected, and to be able to settle and just be in the present moment and to sit in quiet solitude with just ourselves. So the fourth benefit of working with Seraphinite is that it helps with out of body experiences. And that's a unique ability of Seraphinite. And it may sound strange, like what, what qualifies as out of body experience and why might I want to seek that? But it helps you achieve that feeling of soaring like the angels. If you are feeling constrained by your body, for instance, there are many meditation practices that want you to expand your sense of self beyond the physical body, to not just see yourself as a physical presence, but also as an energetic and a spiritual presence. And that can be difficult for some people because we are so tied to this body in this life. And sitting with Seraphinite helps you to release that connection with our skin boundary and helps us expand outward. But also, this is a gemstone that helps you with any other ability that is beyond your physical body. So dream journeying, vision questing, astral journeying, if that is something that you are practicing or studying, then Seraphinite helps you with that practice because it's helping you release the constraints and attachment that we have to the physical body. Now, in other practical real life situations, this is a stone that's really great for those who are in hospice care. It can be a deep fear for people who are dying to release this physical body. And Seraphinite is a stone that will help them ease that fear, that will help them ease their transition away from this physical body and out into wherever we go after death. So if you're taking care of somebody in hospice care, or if you are in hospice care, then this is a wonderful stone. It's very soothing, protective, and helps us feel bigger and greater than this little body is. So Seraphinite is just a beautiful stone. It helps us to access our pure, loving, and energetic self. It really helps us tap in to our spiritual essence and remind us that we are a being of the universe. So I hope that you have found this useful. And if you do feel like Seraphinite is a gemstone that you would like to work with more, then in two days on Friday, I will be doing a guided meditation for Seraphinite. And you do not need a piece of this gemstone to benefit from the guided meditation. But if anything in this video or any of the prompts that I bring up during the meditation really speak to you, they feel familiar, or they trigger you a little bit, then that is a sign that you should get some Seraphinite and work with it some more. If you are new to this channel, or if you've been watching my videos and you enjoy them and you have not already subscribed, then please subscribe to the channel because I talk about a different gemstone every single week and the real life situations that they can help you with, that they can help inspire and cultivate transformation and change in your life. Thank you so much for joining me today to talk about Seraphinite, and I hope to see you during the guided meditation.